A warm welcome to AD4 TV Radio News Extract, coming to you from Abuja, Nigeria's capital city. I am Jessica Ochai. Cheating remains focal in most discussions about relationships. While reactions or responses to these vary among parties, cheating in relationships are often emotive. AD4 TV Radio stepped out of the public space to gauge the pulse of individuals when faced with a cheating spouse. As a partner in a relationship, would you overlook, forgive, or react to displeasure to a cheat? That's the issue we sought responses to. The ties that bind most romantic relationships are often complex and differ among parties involved. However, in most situations, trust and commitment are key considerations. In the advent of infidelity, many individuals express a feeling of betrayal and a breach of trust. It's not as easy as it sounds. Yet there are some circumstances that you you wonder really if you can actually forgive or not. It's actually difficult, you know. It's easy for you to just say, yeah, I will forgive her when it doesn't happen to you. But when it does happen to you, that's when you really know how it feels like and all that. So seriously, <laughs> it depends. In some circumstances, individuals are minded to forgive a cheating partner. The bond may either cease or continue. Yes, I will forgive him, but the relationship will not continue. Yeah, especially when I catch you one, two, three, four times doing it. I might forgive you and we'll go out different ways. We see on the, on the way, we say hi, hello. That communication might still be there, but that intimacy might not be there anymore. Trust issues, however, become a casualty in all circumstances. First question, why will you even cheat? If you are ready to cheat, that means both of us should just break up. Because there's nothing there again for you. That means you don't love me anymore. For you to go outside and go and cheat, that means you're going to hurt me. So there's no love between us anymore. So what's the use of us wasting our time? Just go. But if it was a mistake, let's like say a drunk mistake or that kind of, no problem. If that's if you can settle this, but the trust between both of us will not be there anymore. I won't have trust for that person anymore. Relationship practitioners say the level of commitment put into a relationship conversely determines the faith, trust, and confidence that bind the partners involved. Olami Dai Telegbe, AD4 T Radio, Abuja. Remember, coronavirus is real. Ensure you wash your hands regularly, use alcohol-based hand sanitizers, wear your masks, besides maintaining social distancing. And that's it for AD4 TV Radio News Extract coming to you from Abuja, Nigeria's capital. You can join the conversation on our website at www.ad4tvradio.com. Please follow us on our social media platforms at AD4 TV Radio on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and Instagram. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel at 84 TV Radio as well. Many thanks for watching. I am Jessica Ochai.